All right, uh, TI, yeah, this is a video showing you how to remove suspected um, implants. Um, basically, you know I'm into physics. Physics, the foundation, fundamental of all other sciences. From physics, uh, we learn what an electron is. From knowing the electron, we start learning what chemicals are. From learning what chemicals are, we start learning biology. So physics is fundamental to everything. So I got myself a safety pin. Yeah. Um, now, obviously, if you look back in history, before when we was all still Africans, and even after that, um, every man used to have to be everything in the family. You have to be the doctor. You have to be the scientist, the engineer, the builder. So even Imhotep the man who's credited with building the oldest pyramid they've found that's related to Egypt was all those things, was everything, all scientists even Amenhotep, Tat Moses or Moses um, these are people that used to be taught science fundamentally before Isaac Newton invented, um, defined what physics was physics was still being used because how did they build the pyramids if they didn't know physics so anyway um, this is a safety pin no actually it's a sewing pin <laughs> yeah um, obviously I've got this um, bad boy here that I've been watching for quite a while it seems to have dried out and physics will tell me everything you use even if you use your mobile phone for a long time you start to wear and tear and starts to look old age is something that happens to everything that we've manufactured even our bodies um, so if you use I don't know um, a shoe for so, for so long it will grow old so when you look at these things and they start to look old um, that's when you start to remove them but when they're young I don't know if you can see these two here yeah when they're young looking in terms of physics uh, you leave those until the uh, well until like a mobile phone worn out or a shoe worn out it starts to look like that yeah but this one seems to have really matured yeah um and this is a wound yeah uh, let me see how did i do it um i think i must have scratched myself or there was um uh, i must have burned myself i can't remember anyway but that's a wound that's how a wound looks like that don't look like no wound you see the difference you must scrape you know scrape you know don't self-harm no scrape yeah I don't know surgery I don't know any of that shit but I know physics yeah I hope this shit works I've removed a few I removed um where is it that one oh, hold on you can see that there is um these two which appear to be young ones but there was one big mature one there that I removed so I'm gonna try and do the same thing with this one yeah and as as you can see I removed it and it hasn't come back um, since then yeah so but this one's darkened out yeah oh, I don't know if you can see it again there yeah it's darkened out and it's ready to be removed so just a nice little scraping action I don't know if I can get it into the shot oh. to scrape off the skin yeah don't dig I'm not self-harming yeah just scrape scrape away the top skin because it's not embedded underneath it's on top just scrape off this the top top just scrape it off just scrape it um, get a nice good scrape away um, no blood to be drawn don't go that deep you just try and take something out on the surface out from the surface of the skin yeah so that's the skin opened up the skin is open yeah um, uh, let me just remove the skin uh, I'll keep the skin just in case some of it went with it um, so there it is again 
and it's still dark there so I just removed that bit yeah. and now you kind of scrape it away um, By lots of skin. See if I could impinge it. There it is. There it is. Most of it is skin. I wish you could see to see it close up. Remove it. So it's on a contrast. Mm -hmm. Here we are. Um, and the other bit of skin that I had there. So as you can see, I completely opened it up. There's no blood flowing. Yeah. I don't have a petri dish, but I'm gonna save that. Um, you know, I'm kind of saving back. I don't know. Yeah. Just a little, you have to have patience. I don't have patience. I just fucking. Yeah. Um, Try and save as much of it as I can. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Just removing the other side of the skin. Yeah. 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 I just scratch that one away. You got a nice good opening there. Like a little rat. I just scrape the skin away and it's no longer dark like that. Yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah. So that has gone. And now I will save it. Um, but basically, that's what I wanted to actually um, share with you. That when you know physics, um, you can imagine what all the other sciences are. I just carried out a minor operation on myself uh, to remove an implant. Um, try not to do anything to yourself that will involve you penetrating the skin fully. Try and just only treat things which are on the surface or in the skin layers but anything beyond where you touch nerves and, and uh, blood do not do that and I'll say that to you now don't try this at home um, because um, I'm not trained but it's just that uh, um, I'm switched off <laughs> if switch on means that you're scripted and uh, you go base one, base two, base three, base four when you're dating um, and um, you say the right things, then I'm switched off. <laughs> um, if you're switched on, uh, obviously, uh, if you suspect anything like that, go and get it checked out. Um, but if you haven't checked it out and you need alternative ways of healing yourself, I'm not medically trained um, and I'm very, very experimental, very experimental. I don't have any anything conclusive and Another thing, I don't believe in helping or hindering people. I believe in being neutral because the Almighty lets everything happen, so must die because I'm just a human being. Um, but that's how you treat yourself. And um, I don't know if you can see. Uh...